Okay. Good morning. Good morning. And how are you doing? Yes, I'm doing well. What about you? Yes, I'm pretty well. Thank you for asking. So, like, uh, is it your day off from your office? Yes, yes. Today is week off. So, if I'm not wrong, you are you are doing a job, I think. Yes, you are right. Yes. So, it has been long time uh, since we met each other. So, please introduce yourself again. I would like to know again. Yeah, yeah, sure. So, as you know, my name is Tanuja, and I'm from Bhopal City. And if I'll talk about my qualification, so I have done engineering from computer science and uh, currently I'm a working professional in one of the IT company and it's been four years uh, in my company and simultaneously I'm running my YouTube. That's all about me. Okay, that's really great. So when did you start your YouTube journey? Uh, it's more than one year. And, okay, it has been one year. And now you are doing a job as well as you are running this YouTube channel. It's really, really great. So like, how do you feel after uh, getting a job and now you are running a YouTube channel? So what was your earlier life and what is your this life? Like, what is what can you see the difference between this and that? OK, so actually I had started my channel because I had to build my confidence level. Uh, so that was my thinking that time. So I had started shooting my videos uh, so that I can improve my confidence level. And gradually I made this kind of platform that I can speak with different people. So I just shifted here and I'm doing this kind of conversational videos. And now I can see that differences in myself that I have improved my communication and also my confidence level also. Because in earlier days I used to uh, fear a lot well, um, while I have to do the conversation with other people. But now I'm a little bit comfortable enough that I can talk with anyone. So yes, I have improved a lot. And if I'll talk about my YouTube growth, so it is kind of secondary part. I'm not bothering about much. But yes, I'm giving my best. If uh, if I can grow on YouTube, that is also OK. But I'm already working, so I'm not bothering about much. But if I'm giving time there also, so I'm just waiting for result also. Yeah, of course. Like uh, running a YouTube channel, it's not because we are going to earn money just because of we we are going to connect each other we are going to know each other that how they are doing and how am i doing so like uh, connecting each other is really very really, uh, important you know we get to know so many things from other people so that is really very really great so when uh, when you uh, got your job so how did you feel that time because it's really very really, uh, biggest have happiness like for those people who after working so much hard in their life and they got something so of course i would like to know that happiness yes yes you are absolutely right so it is kind of biggest achievement in our life because firstly we want what we want in our life we want a good settled job where i can earn money and uh, yes i if i'm satisfied with that job also so that is a biggest achievement for everyone i would say so in my after completing my college, I appeared for interview uh, for my job purpose. But that time I got rejected in so many interviews because of my communication. So I was very depressed and demotivated also. Like uh, I am kind of a topper that time in my college and school time. And still I didn't get the job. So it was very embarrassing moment for me. But yes, I I was doing my hard work and uh, I was just thinking every everything will be you know everything I will get on right time. So yes, I yes. was just giving my best and yes, fortunately I got placed. Uh, so it was a very happiest moment for me. And uh, yeah, my parents were feeling very proud on me. Like, yes, my daughter has done this thing. So they were very happy. And if you see your parents happy, so definitely you will also feel happy. So yes, that, that's really great, great, great. Like you have done so many things in your life. So of course I would like to see uh, on that moment where the people you know face uh, and do do some hard hard work and after doing hard work they, uh, they if they don't achieve anything so they just feel sad and they just uh, make ourselves motivate so that time it's really very really difficult to make them understand and they don't listen to anyone they just think that I'm not going to do further anything because I'm I'm all the time just getting fail fail fail. So uh, as you told me that as you mentioned here that yes, I also faced so many uh, interview and I uh, got mm -hmm. rejected so many times. 
so it's really very difficult because you have handled yourself in that situation you didn't give up you you thought that no i should work more and more so that is really very good yeah so most of the yeah. people they just give up you know they just think mm -hmm. oh it's really very hard not to crack for me i all the time fail fail so it's really very difficult so yes I you know like i i have learned so many things uh, because of my rejection only Uh, because yeah. that time i was not focusing on learning english language or not focusing on my communication but uh, i got failed so many times so i was getting the ideas like uh, uh, how they are uh, asking you the question and how can you give the answer and because of that so many interviews i got the ideas also and i have learned lot of new things like uh, what are the question they are asking and what was my uh, what i was doing whatever question they were asking i was just writing down after the interview and i was just preparing uh, those question also like yes i have to search the answer for that question if i don't know in that interview so i was doing this things so i think i can say that if you are getting demotivated i used to cry a lot when i was getting rejected in any interview when i came to my home and i was just started crying uh, crying and crying only <laughs> like i'm i'm doing nothing and what I, where i'm lacking i don't know why i'm getting rejected but after crying uh, like one or two hours i just keep myself motivated yes you have to do it tanuja and you have to do it <laughs> yeah and actually the thing is that you know uh, one time i uh, in the morning i got up like uh, like five months ago i got up early in the morning and i didn't tell any uh, any of my family member that i am going to face a interview just because of i knew that if i got rejected so they just say that yeah uh, uh, you got fail and my friends and my family member they always they feel sad when i when you go from your house to face any uh, fa uh, to get find any uh, opportunity so of course your family member they uh, they expect from you that okay my son and my daughter is going to find any job so of course they will uh, they will success in that but uh, mm -hmm. in that in that condition when you get fail and you just come back home so it's really very sad moment for you and as well as your family member so there was a time when i got up in the morning i got fresh and i got dressed then my mom asked me hey janan where are you going i said mm -hmm. i didn't want to tell them that i am going to face a interview but i had to mm -hmm. tell so uh, my my mom got happy that okay you are going to uh, face an interview for a job so she told uh, she told every of my each and every family members and they all the family, uh, my all the family member they were excited all the, that time so mm -hmm. i went there and i faced an interview but i got rejected oh, mm -hmm. that time i thought oh i shouldn't have told my family member that i am going to face an interview now see i got rejected so i am going to home how how should i how can i go to home because my fam all the family member were must be uh, thinking that okay ganen got uh, must have been selected must have been selected now but now the situation is changed so i was i was coming home being sad it was really very really hard not to care. but as soon as i reached my home i got a call from that uh, like uh, that uh, and they they said ganen you you have been uh, you have been selected for this job or uh, then i got happy then i said oh my god thank god mm -hmm. that i am going i am not going to uh, like uh, uh, empty hand for, uh, to my uh, to my home mm -hmm. so then i told my all the family member that yes i got selected then i then all the family member got happy but it was like uh, if i talk about job so it was a private job i didn't uh, do uh, so many months of work over there just then i quit quit it so but it it is really very hard not i want to say i wanted to say here that when people go to face any interview from their home so they have hope but when they come and being rejected so it's like uh, there is nothing in their life they are totally broke up they just uh, think that oh everything is nothing is possible to get from for them so it's happen okay. so handling ourselves in that situation it's really very really difficult so who was uh, inspiration for you that time when you uh, rejected got rejected so many times so who was inspiration and what did you think about that that how did you handle yourself okay as i told you that i was crying a lot whenever i get rejected i come to home and i was i am just starting crying uh, you know like uh, everyone is getting selected why i am not selecting so yeah. uh, in my family member uh, i would say that my my 
father is my inspiration because he always you know always uh, motivate me like yes uh, you know uh, whatever things you are getting it you you will get on the right time only so don't yes. bother about this thing okay so this in this job you got rejected so maybe you will get better than this this job and yeah it happened also and i was always uh, had this kind of positive thinking that yes if my parents have believe on me then why are not believing on myself if my yes. father is believing on me so i should also believe that yes on the right time i will get a job and when the, the moment came and i just got up in the morning and i just saw the mail that tanuja you had selected for this job so i was just you know uh, i hugged my uh, father and i was just started you know my father father told me that yes uh, that is the thing i had told you earlier also that on the right time you will get and i have believe on yourself like yes you can do because you have the knowledge you are also a studious girl so and you are doing hard work also so you will get and that time was very happiest moment for me really yes yes so of course like uh, we should not uh, like think about our failure we just think about our hard work that how how much we are doing for getting this job you know so being rejected is like normal thing it we get chance to learn more and more from our failure you know it's really very uh, nobody can like uh, being be sad and they just think uh, they are they just think that okay uh, we should give up so nobody can i must say that nobody should think this because mm -hmm. we we just keep on working on it like earlier uh, i was thinking about my english language that okay yanen you don't have any qualification so uh, you you can't learn english this is really mm -hmm. very hard track to learn but i didn't give up i made up my mind that i always think positive to uh, towards my dream i said i thought okay let it be if i if i don't learn so it's okay but i have to work on it whenever i get time so i of course i will work on it so i just whenever i get, got like to uh, 5 minute 10 minute 10 minute because sometimes some day uh, sometime i didn't get time so i didn't uh, think about it but i slowly i just keep on kept on working 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 and now i am able to speak and I, by how uh, like by this way i have achieved my dream a little bit that just one day i was thinking that uh, i i i also want to be become fluent english and now i can uh, i can talk in english i can talk to anyone there is no problem i can understand as well so this is like uh, just be, it just uh, it depends on our mind that we do we don't we never think any negative thing you know we all the all the time we just think positive for us because uh, if i talk about out of people they always humiliate you they just uh, this demotivate you that it's uh, it, it it is not for you it janen it's really very really hard not to play for you you don't you should not do this you just do whatever you 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 are eligible for to do but they don't mm -hmm. let you do anything special in your life i am telling you uh, if it, it it could be your neighborhood and it could be your friends and relatives so they always time they they don't let you go further and go ahead in their life they don't want you to let uh, uh, they don't let you do anything something special in your life so yeah it's happened but we should yeah. not listen to anyone we just think ourselves because this, this is our dream so we have to think our for our dream so yes, yeah this yes. you know i have also learned two things like you shouldn't have self rejection if you mm -hmm. are rejecting yourself like yes i can't do this things and you are making the excuses even i was doing the same thing when i was not able to speak english so i used to think i am from hindi medium background and i didn't focus on learning this language so that's why i am unable to speak but now i think i realized this things no we shouldn't do this things like self rejection and other yeah. thing is that we shouldn't listen other people what they are saying so we have this mindset like what other people will say So this two thing, if you will overcome, then definitely you can achieve whatever you want to do. Of course. So that is this is our life. So we have to think for our life that how can we uh, decorate our life? What doing what? Uh, and if you listen any uh, other person, so definitely they don't want you to do something else in your life. They always want you to destroy your life. So this thing happen. So we yeah. just keep working. Uh, our from uh, to our goals we just keep, keep keep on working for it so that is all like 
and uh, and this is really very great thing that you have mentioned uh, f like uh, for your job how did you get your job and how 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 much like you have faced for getting this job so it's really very uh, good for other people as well that the people who just uh, be sad all the time from their failure suppose they are going to get motivate from this video so that they just think that okay like uh, uh, like uh, we should not be sad from our failure yes so, yes you are absolutely right so okay ma'am that uh, thank you so much that you have given me your uh, precious time and as well as you have mentioned so many things so that is really very really great thank you so much to you as well and you are also motivating you know motivating to all other people who are learning this language so definitely you know uh, we shouldn't make this kind of excuses that we don't have resources and we don't have this thing so that's why we are unable to speak just try you know whatever things you are you want to learn just give it a, a try and definitely you can learn if you have self believe on yourself yeah so we should make ourselves confident and just think uh, positive thing don't uh, don't say that i can't do i can't do of course you can do if uh, if other people can do so you why can't you do you, of course you can do you just think okay. positive thing that and never think that okay it's a really difficult nothing is uh, impossible everything is possible if you if you think so of course everything is possible to do so thank yeah. you so much okay have a nice day okay you too